Hello, my fellow Trash Goblins, and welcome back to the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. <laughs> Last time, we uh, we had one hell of a time with this game, and I, there's a few things I want to try on these new runs, so we're just going to go straight to it. <laughs> this game is ridiculous. I, I'm avoiding looking up any of the other endings. I just want to kind of go into this as blind as I can. I've been told that there's a lot... I don't know if we're going to get every single ending, but um, if if the, I'm going to get some of the bigger ones that I think will make really good changes, like going down the stairs instead of up the stairs to the boss's office, or like they, he was talking about dropping off of the, uh, the crane. I want to try that. There's just a few things that I do want to try. So we'll, um, <laughs> we're just going to go. Um, thank you everyone for being here. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Let's, uh, <laughs> Let's experience this together. If my uh, controller would work, yes? There we go. Okay. <laughs> oh, God. This is the yeah, we're skipping this. We know the story of Stanley. Okay, we're leaving. Okay. All these co-workers were gone. Ooh. What could it mean? Uh, Stanley decided death. to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Mm. Wait, there's a door there. Let me in. How do I get over? There's other doors. I need to get to the other doors. Okay. New missions. New missions, new deciding factors. Open everything. Close everything. Nope. Go away. Punch the painting off the wall. <laughs> that doesn't work. Nope. Nope. When Stanley came okay, to a so set we of two are gonna go doors, left. He entered the door on his left. Okay. No. No. Office. Yet there was not a single person. Talk less so you don't get fired, by the way. I missed that last disbelief. time. Stanley decided to go up to his boss's oh. office, hoping he might Stanley stepped into the broom closet, but there was nothing here, so he turned around and got back on track. Is there something here? Is there something in here? Can I take the broom? There was nothing here. No choice to make, no path to follow. Just an empty broom closet. I don't trust no you. To still be here. I don't trust you. There's a buzzing. Feeling that Stanley was still just sitting in the broom closet. Oh, hold on. I'll, he wasn't I'll actually say. There we go. At sitting. least if there was something to interact with, he'd be justified in some way. As it is, he's literally just standing there doing sweet FA. <laughs> <laughs> are you are you really still in the broom closet? Yes. Yeah, standing around doing nothing? Why? Oh, technically I'm sitting. Some explanation here. I'm I'm genuinely confused. I don't trust you. You do realize there's no choice or anything in here, right? If I'd said Stanley walked past the broom closet, at least you would have had a reason for exploring it to find out. But it didn't even occur to me, because literally, this closet is of absolutely no significance to the story whatsoever. Your story I or my story? To mention it. It, it's, this is my story, not yours. Your game, my story. Maybe to you, this is somehow its own branching path. Maybe when you go talk about this with your friend, you'll say, Ow! Oh, did you get the broom closet ending? What? The broom <laughs> closet ending was my favorite. Yes, I, I live here now. I'm closing the store. I live here now. Give me the broom closet ending. I live here now. Stanley was fat and ugly and really rich. Really <laughs> <laughs> he probably only got the job because of a family connection. That's how stupid We is. just that started. <laughs> also, Stanley is addicted to drugs and hookers. That sounds like a good time. <laughs> Don't do drugs. <laughs> well, I've come to a very definite conclusion about what's going on right now. You're dead. Brain dead. You got to this broom closet, explored it a bit, and were just about to leave because there's nothing here when a physical malady of some sort shut down your central nervous system and you collapsed on the keyboard. Sure, I'll go In with that one. In a situation one. like this, the responsible thing is to alert someone nearby so as to ensure that your body is taken care of before it begins to decompose. That Hello? sounds good. Anyone who happens to be nearby, 
The person at this computer is dead. <laughs> they have fallen prey to any number of your countless human physiological vulnerabilities. I can't. I can't. I'm trying to just. Speeches. Please remove their corpse from the area and instruct another human to take their place, making sure they understand basic first person I'm video mechanics <laughs> and filling them in on the history of narrative tropes. In I'm video trying gaming. so hard so to just and insightful commentary of let it go and talk. I just, I can't. It's. All right. When you've done that, just step out into the hallway. No! I live here now. You call me fat and ugly and told me I'm addicted to drugs and hookers. I will live my addicted life as a fat slob within this broom closet. This is what I, we, I'm going to stand here for the whole duration of this episode. Nothing? Absolutely nothing? You better you better end the game. I'm dead. I'm I'm a fat slob who's addicted to drugs and hookers. You better end the game before I give you a virus. Okay, now I actually feel insane. Uh Okay. What if I leave the broom closet and go back in? Are you going to say something then? Ah, second player. You too. <laughs> I'm at the mercy of an entire species of aliens. Perhaps there's a monkey nearby you can hand the controls to. A fish? Fungus? Nope. Look, you can hammer out the details. I'm not particularly picky. I'll just be waiting for when you're ready to pick up the story again. Um, I'm a stay. I'm doubling down. I don't know how long to wait to exit and then re-enter. He's not saying anything. I'm watching the recording timer to literally see how long it's been. Nothing? Can I just stand in this corner? Okay. Is it going to shut on me? Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs nope. to his boss's office. This is what I wanted to do. And oh god. Memo. I cannot read it. Okay. <laughs> okay. Ooh. But Stanley just couldn't do it. He considered the possibility of facing his boss. Admitting he had left his post during work hours, he might be fired for that. And in such a competitive economy, why had he taken that risk? More All blood because coffee. he believed everyone had vanished. His boss would think he was crazy. Oh. And then something occurred to Stanley. Maybe, he thought to himself, maybe I am crazy. All of my co-workers blinking mysteriously no. out of existence in a single moment for no uh, reason at all. This None is of it a made loop. any logical sense. And as Stanley pondered this, he began to make other strange observations. For example, why couldn't he see his feet when he looked down? Oh, why did Jesus! Why close automatically behind him wherever? He went? <laughs> and for that matter, Are you really? His were starting to look pretty familiar. Yes. Were they simply repeating. No, Stanley said to himself. This no, they is are. All too strange. This can't be real. And at last, he came to the conclusion that had been on the tip of his tongue. He just hadn't found the words for it. I'm dreaming, he yelled. Oh, this is this is the dream, dream ending? Oh, what a relief. Is this Stanley a dream ending? To have finally found an answer, an explanation. His co workers weren't actually gone. He wasn't going to lose his job. He wasn't coffee. crazy after all. Does the coffee keep he moving forward? Himself, I suppose I'll wake up soon. I'll have to go back to my boring real life job pushing buttons. I may as well enjoy this while I'm still lucid. So he imagined himself flying and began to gently float above the ground. Oh then God. He imagined himself oh my God. Space on a magical star field. And it too appeared. It oh. was so much fun. And Stanley <laughs> marveled that he had still not woken up. How was he remaining so lucid? 
And then perhaps the strangest question of them all entered Stanley's head. Uh, it's strange One, enough. He was amazed he hadn't asked himself sooner. Why is there a voice in my head dictating everything that I'm doing and thinking? I'm, I'm not. Now the voice was describing itself being considered by Stanley, who found it particularly strange. I'm dreaming about a voice describing If you've ever heard the phrase existential dread, think thought. this is it. And while he thought it all very odd, and wondered if this voice spoke to all people in their dreams, <laughs> the truth was that, of course, this was not a dream. How could it be? Was Stanley simply deceiving Let me himself? let me out of this fresh hell. He doesn't have to take responsibility. I don't I don't need this in my life. Stanley is as awake right now as he's ever been in his life. Now hearing the voice speak these words was quite a shock to Stanley. After all, he knew I just I don't know God what to do. That this was in fact a dream. Did the voice not see him float and make the magical stars just a moment ago? How else would the voice explain all that? This voice was a part of himself too. Surely, surely, if he could just existential he dread, he would prove just that he was in a mental breakdown. That That's what this dream. is. So he closed his eyes gently. This is the crushing weight of up. working a nine-to-five job every day. On his skin. The press of the mattress on his back. This. No, nope, this is just a mental breakdown. This one. Let me wake up, he thought to himself. Oh my God! I'm with this dream, I wish it to be over. Let me go back to my job. Let me continue pushing the buttons, please. It's all I want. No, it's not. I want my apartment, and my wife, and my job. What the all hell? All I want is my life exactly the way it's always been. My life is normal. I am well, normal. What's that on the left side of the screen? Everything Hold on. will be fine. There's something like right. I am okay. There's something on the left. Okay, that is just a mental breakdown. Stanley began screaming. Please, someone! <laughs> My name is Stanley. I have a boss. I have an office. I am real. Please, just someone tell me I am real. I must be real. I must be. Can anyone hear my voice? Who am I? Who am I? And everything went black. <laughs> oh my God! This is the story of a woman named Mariella. What? Mariella woke up on a day like any other. She arose, got dressed, gathered her belongings, and walked to her place of work. What? But on this particular day, her walk was interrupted by the body of a man who had stumbled through town talking and screaming to himself, and then collapsed dead on the sidewalk. And although she would soon turn to go call for an ambulance, for just um. a few brief moments, she considered the strange man. He was obviously crazy. I, I, this much she knew. I, uh, Everyone knows what crazy people uh, look like. And in that moment, she thought to herself how lucky she was to be normal. I am sane. I am in control of my mind. I know what is real and what isn't. This is a clear definition and in a of the voices way, told me to do it. <laughs> better. But then she remembered the meeting she had scheduled for that day. The very important people whose impressions of her would affect her career. And by extension, the rest of her life. She had no time for this, so it was only a moment what? that she stood there, staring down at the body. And then she turned and ran. Okay, I'm dead now. Great. That was... Okay, first you cheat me out All of a broom closet ending. Gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Okay. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Now it just makes me question, can I just jump out the window? That's that's horrible. That was a horrible thought. Okay, so what's next? Um, we did. So we went down the stairs. When Stanley came to a no, there's the right. The doors, this was not the correct way. And then there was the door on the and left. Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps okay. he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Yeah, we got the employee lounge right here. We're just going to go straight through it. Yes, truly a room worth admiring. But eager to get back to business, <laughs> Stanley took yeah, the first it was open door this and one. left. Yeah. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door, and got back on track. Okay, I see. 
Okay, no, we're going down. No, 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 no. You don't get to do that to me. Bye-bye. <laughs> I win. What? But Stanley didn't want to go back to the office. He wanted to wander about and get even further off track. Yes, I do. So now in order to get back, he needed to go, um, uh, uh, Don't have this one in your script, do ya? Yeah, it's, um... Oh, no. No, it's too <laughs> right, my mistake. <laughs> Well, let me open. Now I want to go left. Fuck you. Ah, rude. No, 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 not the right. Why would I have ever said I'm it was I'm going to the kill right? you. What was I thinking? It's clearly. Oh dear, would you hold on? There are one? three doors. Pick one, or let me pick one. Now, let's see. We went down right, left, down. Left, Dude, you built right. the building. Yep. Yep. Okay. Okay. Yes. I've got it now. This story is absolutely, definitely this way. Oh, there is an... Am I going to get run over? Let me choose a door. It's so rude. Come on. All right. Uh, down. Can I go around? Nope. Okay. I go down. Now we're in a horror. Oh! No! 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 This isn't right at all. You're not supposed to be here. Yet. Okay, where's this is mine? All a spoiler. Quick, Stanley, close your eyes. Okay, four, two, two seven, oh, right? We're oh, right down there. It's all rubbish now. The whole story completely unusable. How about rather than waste my time trying to salvage this nonsense, we'll what? just restart the game from the beginning. And this time, not again, not again, not again. Don't wander so far off track. Hmm? God, I okay. hate you. <laughs> From the top. No. <laughs> All of his co workers. Okay. Um, what did it mean? <laughs> Stanley decided to sir, go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had seen I decided the nothing. I would like to go 420, please. Thank you very much. You locked me out. You dick. Okay. Um. Hmm. Yeah, there's other doors. I want to go. Okay. Um, go to the right. Wait. What? What? No. I, no, I restarted. I swear, I definitely restarted. Whoa. The game. Oh, completely fresh. <laughs> Everything should be. Oh, did something change? Stanley, did you change anything when we were back in that room with all the monitors? Did you move the story somewhere, or? Uh, I don't know. Hold on. Why am I asking you? I'm the one who wrote the story. Good question. It was right here just a minute ago. I know for sure that it's here somewhere. Oh my god, okay. you lost the script. It's an adventure. Oh, Come, Stanley. Let's find the story. Oh my god, what am I doing? Okay, we're gonna go. Oh, wow. Okay, um, I'm gonna go this way. Oh no, what have I done? It's literally just a maze. Did I come back to the... No. Uh, oh. I'll say it. This is the worst adventure I've ever been on. I can promise you there definitely was a story here before. Okay, well, what about this? Do we, just, do we need to restart the what game What about this? Again? What's this? Well, I find it unlikely that we'll ever There's thing. Oh, God. Over and over Never again. mind. But it's got to be better than this. Okay, let's give it a shot. Why oh, not? Oh no. Well, oh, god damn it. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Stanley decided to ignore the hell out of everything. <laughs> okay, yep. <laughs> I might be remembering this wrong. Yeah, you it's think? Possible the story is back where we just came from. Okay, then open Why the don't damn we go door. Back the other direction and see if we missed anything. Sure. You're not even letting me click on doors anymore. Uh, coffee. Coffee's still there. Looks like this place is under construction. Oh, what the hell? Can I please? Aha! I knew we'd miss what? something. The story. Here it comes. No, wait. Never mind. <laughs> Not the story. Okay, let's head back the other way I... and retrace our steps. Oh, God. What do you do? Okay. 
This looks like death. Now this... Well, I'll be honest. I don't recognize this place at all. Is this the story? You wrote the so. damn thing! I can't quite recall, but I believe my story took place in an office building. It, is that correct? Hmm. Do you remember, Stanley? No! Would well, you know what? Since I've completely forgotten what we were supposed to be doing, how about this? You win! Congratulations! Yay! You put in a lot of hard work, and it really paid off. So, good job. Oh, no. No, I don't feel right Can about Can I just jump out the window, we please? I'm done. I'm done! I'm done! Work for that win. Some people win fair and square, and this was not one of those situations. Okay. Okay. I'm getting weirded out by whatever this place is. I and can we go somewhere? This time, I have to restart. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> All right. I've got a solution. This time, to make sure we don't get lost, I've employed the help of the Stanley Parable Adventure Line. Just follow the line. How simple is that? That's not the right way, though. Uh, am I getting it locked in? I don't really like to. No, no, I'm down. We're leaving it up to the line from now on. <laughs> the line TM. Why did you have to TM the line? Oh, no. Oh, my God. Oh, God. Okay. Follow the line. Follow the yellow brick line. Okay. You see? The line knows where the story is. It's Does it? It's this direction. Onward, Stanley, to destiny. No, here's a thought. Wouldn't wherever we end up be our destination, even if there's no story there? Or to put it another way, is the story of no destination still a story? Simply by the act of moving forward, are we implying a journey such that oh a destination God. is inevitably conjured into being via the very manifestation of the nature of life itself? Okay, Stanley, I need to follow this train of thought for a minute. Just stick with me. Oh, okay. Now we can both agree that the nature of existence is in fact a byproduct of I now one have a headache again. experience of that existence, right? I very okay. small brain, man. Now, I don't What is going on with the line DM? Inside of yep, your agreed. experience of this office, is this office in fact the Can I run on the walls? Own relative okay, experiential uh, yep, mental yep, subjective yep, construct. Yep. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on. That got a bit weird back there. Well, I'd like to apologize. Not sure what are you doing there. to me? You know what? I think what we need right now is a bit of music to lighten the Oh, mood. no. What the? <laughs> oh, what the hell? <laughs> this is not where we were a few seconds ago. I can't with this. Okay. Oh, what are we doing? Help me, please. Cut the music. Go back uh, and look at that fern. What? Stanley, this fern will be very important later in the story. Make sure you study it closely and remember it carefully. It's you now burned into my anything. brain. That that leaf and that uh, that grass texture is very nice. Okay, can we continue on with this? Wait, oh, we're back at the office. No. No, no, line. You do know we're looking for the Stanley Parable, right? The line story? TM. Is any of this ringing a bell? What? <laughs> oh, no, 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 not again. How could you have done this to us? After we trusted you, after everything Pirate. we've been through, you... No, oh, I can't take this anymore. To hell with it. Restart. Oh, I have such a... What? What are we doing now, man? I hate you know what Stanley. I say forget the adventure line. What's it ever done for us? <laughs> We're intelligent people, right? No. Why can't we make up our own story? Something exciting, daring, mysterious. All this all sounds perfectly doable. Why Does don't it? we simply start wandering in well, I don't know. How about this direction? Where are you having me go? Okay. Fine. I've got no other options. Now. Yes, this is exciting. Just is me and Stanley forging a new path, a new story. Well, it could be anything. What do you want our story to be? Go Over. Wild. Use your imagination. I would Whatever like to be, Stanley, not be here. I'm ready for it. Stanley can't talk. You did not no, decide. No, not 
plan. Just, I'd also uh, like to veto the line from having any role in our awesome new story. No lines or monitor rooms. Just don't acknowledge it. And we should be fine. It's dear. <laughs> it's dear. <laughs> Why? Why is this a thing? What is my existence? Oh, ah, existential dread. Choice. We get to make a decision. No, no. From here, the story is in our control. How important we mustn't squander the opportunity. I hate. In fact, I believe I need a minute to think here. Just walk in circles for a minute. Okay. Okay. So I know that each door has to lead somewhere. I Which went from not listening to just following everything to I was told. There must be a Because I'm so brain dead at this point. Here. And that in turn means that Stop our walking in circles corresponds with the counter inverted reverse door's origin. So starting from the right, let us ask, will taking the right door lead us to where we're going? And since the answer is clearly yes, then by all accounts, the door on the right is the correct one. Another victory for logic. Come, Stanley. Our destiny awaits. Oh, I can't even shoot. The confusion. Nope. You've been playing the confusion ending for 17 minutes. Oh, hold up. What's this? Hmm. What hmm. the hell? The confusion ending. You're telling me that's what this is? It's all one Stanley giant ending. Play story was friend and, and we're supposed to restart the, the game, game was... eight, eight times? That's really how all this goes? Okay, so we're on the it's fourth restart. Determined? Fifth so narrator forget to the no. Schedule, I restart again. Then what? Am I just supposed to forget? Well, what if I don't want to forget? My mind goes blank. Oh simply my because it's god. Here on this this thing. War. What I I need to pause. It definitely is a confusion ending. Oh. What the hell? Well, who consulted me? Why don't I get no. to decide? Why don't I get a say in all of this? Is it really? No, it can't be. I, d I don't want it to be. I, I don't want the game to keep restarting. I, I don't want to forget what's going on. After a long really time, like Stanley this. dies. I won't restart the game. I won't do it. I won't do it. I won't do it. Can I sit in the chair? And the timer to stopped. Does that mean? Um, did we do it? Did we break the cycle? I don't know. Um, whatever it is that made this schedule. How would we even know? Will someone come for us? Wander in the blackness, find a bookstore, get bored and leave. So, okay. Oh my god. I guess now we just wait. You know, I suppose in some way that this is a kind of story. Wouldn't you agree? No! I'm not quite sure if we're in the destination or the journey. Though they're always saying that life is about the journey and not the destination. I have so my I head. that's where we are right now. We'll find out, won't we? Eventually. Well, in the yeah, meantime, so you... Oh! Jade, what the hell? Oh, don't tell me we're gonna go through the whole thing. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Okay. The, the doors? Okay, the door's still there. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. This was not the correct way to the meeting. It literally room, just restarted. Okay, okay. Well. Perhaps he wanted to stop oh, by the my head. lounge first, just to admire it. No, I'm going to go wow. throw myself yes. off of that um, this room, thing. But eager and to uh, that, to that'll be the perfect Stanley ending to this. First open door on his left. To this one. Nope. Stanley was so nope. bad at following directions, it's incredible nope. he wasn't fired years ago. Nope. Nope. But in his eagerness to prove that he is in control of the story and no one gets to tell him what to do, Stanley leapt from the platform and plunged to his death. Yes. Good job, Stanley. Everyone thinks you are very powerful. Me strong. Oh my god, I can't with this. Okay, um... <sighs> Oh my god. Okay. That was another great session with this game. I cannot comprehend my mm. Mm. Yeah, okay. So 
I'm do. I'm probably gonna do one more episode with this. There's a few more things I want to do. Uh, I think there's. I think there's only like a few more things I can do, so I think it will only be one more episode. But we shall see what happens. Um, Jesus, this game is great, written very well, but also. I thought the plot of Kingdom Hearts was convoluted. Holy crap. <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you so much for being here. I do appreciate it. I hope I was able to entertain you as always. And if not, well, I tried. Um, <laughs> have a wonderful time, guys. I'm going to be going to bed. Have a good one, everybody. My freaking head.